Hey you guys, welcome back to the channel. It's your buddy Wilson, playing some more indie horror. Today we have Pillar of Rust. This is a free Ichio horror game I found. This is a PS1 graphic style, silent hilly kind of walking simulator. And uh, yeah, about what I know about it. Let's try it out. You hold the paper in your hand. It's folded, overly worn, and stained with tears. You unfold it. You glance at the words and then quickly fold it back up again. She promised that she'd go there with you, all the way to the end. You didn't make it in time, and she went ahead without you. Who's she? Mary? Mary, is that you? Have you seen a little girl? What the hell? What? The hell is this? I wish I could be near you, hold you, hear your voice. We speak through these walls. Bone, distance. There's another. I don't want to be alone here. I don't want to be without you. Tank controls. I suck at tank controls. It's over here. What is this? Is there something shiny over there? God, this is... What the frig? This, these controls and camera, I don't even know. Yeah. Feels like a prison sentence. There's no bars keeping me in. Lying in bed again. Unable to move. Just trying to... Just try and get some quiet, enough quiet to let me be okay for a moment. What? This is weird. Wah! You know what I can't turn my head at all. Like, yeah, that was that was really weird. I am stuck here alone. Well, somebody's working those chains. Trying to get out of this place. No! The walls aren't real. So let's walk through them and get out of here. They were real enough for Georgie. I'm just stuck in my head. I'm sorry, lady. We'll get you out of here. Why am I locked in this place? Um, you feel guilty about something. Is that why? Do, 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 do. Are we finally here? I missed the train that night. I was stuck overnight at the station. It was just me and her. I just wanted to be together. I often walk through this dream, like many of them. They're carved into my memories. When I sleep, I often return here, but I know I'm alone here. There are memories I have, little reminders. I want to put them in the trash. Okay. So, we gotta put stuff in the trash?
Look in the trash? Yeah. A strange coffee mug. This looks familiar. What? This. This is the... There's a pair of these. I made this as a token of love. Like love and shit, man. Love and shit. Yeah, let's look in there. What's in there? Just trash. An old, can, an old pop can. Do these two while we're over here. Like love and shit. I used to scratch strange glyphs into the pages of this book. It used to be, it used to fill me with hope. Like love and hope and shit, man. Like love and shit. Hope. Is one of these going to be dreams? Of course. Look at me. I'm a fucking genius. Photo taken from a dream, man. Like love and hopes and dreams, bro. Alright, let's go. Hopes and dreams. They're in the trash in the subway. Looks like we might have at least one more to find, too. Obviously, two, there's two trash cans. Beep, 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 beep. No? Yeah. Part of a shirt I used to wear. It made me feel close. It made me feel safe. Safety. Then here. Nada? Nothing? Nice, nice fucking rectangle base, triangle base, fucking. Can't leave here. Um, I appreciate the attempt at the uh, tank controls, but this is done like kind of bad. It's difficult. Pointy ass face. Pointy face, lady. Okay, we can't leave here. I get it. It's like it's like the camera doesn't know what to do. It hurts. Everything hurts. My eyes burn. My face raw. I want to scream. I want to cry. I just lie there, plead for a way to sever this connection, to numb these feelings. I can't get out of bed, so I just lie there alone until I fall asleep. <laughs> the hell's this supposed to be? There's a certain pain with being alive, having to deal with the burdens of the world. Yeah, but you'll be alright. Sting of every memory. I remember taking great comfort in all those memories. The small words, the little trinkets, the scribbles on paper, whispers in one's ear. God, you're so dramatic, lady. All of these memories, all the things I held so close to me. There's splinters underneath finger fingernails, a horrible pain. Something that doesn't stop and you can't find relief. What what happened? Um, what happened? Game. I was walking down those stairs, game. Dude. I'd crawl into my dark spaces. 
Block out the sun and the bird song and lie there, nursing open the wounds caused by broken dreams. Oh man, the drama. Not the skin thrash about, bloody, broken, scarred like a wounded animal, wanting freedom from the pain. How am I supposed to cope? I don't know. Smoke weed. How about that? It feels like the light is blood out of my life. I hope that I once the hope that I once had is gone. I feel like wa a walking shell moving through space without aim. Anything I do to make me feel anything other than suffocating to distract my brain from the sorrow I feel. I'm so tired. I'm taking that. Grab your pillow, curl up under a blankie, take a nap. You'll feel better when you wake up, I promise. Jesus Christ. An overwhelming sorrow grips me. The sense of self is dead. Almost feels like I'm one foot in the grave. And wondering if I should step in. Worthlessness. Game. It'd be nice if I could see anything. Every thought I feel about myself is like crawling in the mud with a boulder on my back. I wonder why I bother carrying it. Um, probably don't have a choice, I'd imagine. I mean, because if you had a choice, I don't think you would carry it. I feel myself decaying from the inside, wishing that I could just rot away. I feel naive thinking this would last forever, that I could feel happy forever. Oh my god. What is this chick, 16? I didn't think I'd have to walk this world alone anymore. I thought you were going to love me forever. The light has faded from my life, and I can't help feeling that I'd like to fade from it. Oh, man. Oh, I just want a suey. Why don't you love me? <laughs> Why can't... <laughs> I love you. <laughs> why don't I love me? Well, that's why he doesn't love you. Oh, we're home. Fuck doorways. Safe, hope, dream. Hmm. 
Love. Love, man. What's this one say? What's in here? Open the door? Of course. I wake up and sit there as my body becomes plunged back into reality. I check my phone, that cruel window into the world. I think about you and I can't stop myself from crying. I wish I could just shut it off. I wish I could pull the fucking cord, turn myself off. I want to be near you again. I'm so alone. Okay. Where are we? I loved you so fucking much. Ah. Uh, I hate all these memories. Jesus. Come on, controls. Let's I wanna throw it all away. I just want to throw it all away, and I don't want to think about you anymore. I want to forgive forever, like forever and ever. I want to be held. They they have like cuddle parties and shit. Um, you can go online and like participate in a in a completely non-sexual cuddle party. I hate. Uh, well, I don't think that you... I don't think you might be invited to a cuddle party then. I hate myself so much. Well, that's the problem. You gotta stop hating yourself. You're awesome. Stop hating yourself. You're your own worst critic. You don't have to be sorry. It's fine. Come here. Come get a hug. I touch my scars to see if they still bleed. They have been scarred over. The pain is there. The memory of being hurt, but they... Act as a reminder. I limp along, but I can prop myself up and keep moving forward. Those memories that nod at me again feel warm. It's a different warmth, a bittersweet warmth. One that I was happy to experience. I wonder if all the pain was worth it in the end. Maybe it was. Maybe this is where I was meant to go. Sometimes two souls past diverge. Thank you for everything. Thank you. What's on the desk? Nothing? What's this? There's a bird on that table. What is that? Thank you for everything. Oh, okay. So I guess we're done. We're done there. So yeah, that was Rust. Um, kind of weird. A little bit too depressing for me. Maybe I didn't get it. I probably didn't get it. Um, not a bad game, though. I dug the graphics. I dug the weirdness about it. It was very, definitely very different. Um, I enjoyed the game very much. If you enjoyed it, it's free on Itch.io. Go give it a play. But yeah, that's it for this one, guys. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please uh, please leave a like on it. And uh, please subscribe to the channel. If you enjoy the content that I make, I'm putting out content all the time, guys. Uh, please subscribe. It really helps. And yeah, I will see you guys next time for some more indie horror. Take it easy. It's your buddy Wilson. I'm leaving. See you then. <laughs>